Happy Easter to you, everybody. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. On this Easter, I want to share something with you. Two things, actually. One, Acts chapter number two, there the Bible says that Peter ministry on the day of Pentecost told us of the prophecy, how that it was impossible for grave to hold Jesus in the grave. You know what that means? That no matter what was going to happen, Jesus must rise again from the dead. If they had known that before the day of resurrection or believed it, the pain, the trauma, the depression they suffered in those three days would have been avoided. So I'm asking you today to remember the word of God, that God is faithful. He will fulfill his word and promise as he said. Secondly, I want to call the church to a revival. You see, a few days ago, I saw a picture of a Boeing aircraft that was made or manufactured in 1955. As it was about to take the maiden flight, people were excited as they gathered to watch. But today, when you look at that picture, you will wonder how did people even got into that flight compared to the planes that Boeing is manufactured today. What has happened since 1955 to today, Boeing is improving upon their product. Virtually every company, you talk about it, Apple, any computer that was made 5, 10 years ago, today's computers are better. Where am I going with this? The body of Christ which seems to be the only entity that is dumping down on our most greatest heritage of faith. It is time for us to rise up and build on the heritage of faith and promote the gospel and promote the power. Let the act of our past to be back again. We're supposed to be greater and better. That is what the word of God says. That we go from glory to glory, from faith to faith, and from strength to strength. It is time for the body of Christ to return to the place of the miraculous. That is the way we are going to win this generation. That's why this week at Essential Church in the city of Pasadena, it was all about Bible days revival. We want to win this generation to God. We want to turn the nation around. And I'm praying and crying out, God, give me California. I want to witness his supernatural turnaround in California in the name of Jesus. So wherever you are, across Southern California, I'm inviting you, come on and join me in Pasadena. Let's take over and turn our generation around and renew the covenant of faith of the miraculous and go back to the heritage of the act of the apostles and build upon it to take the church to the next generation. Happy resurrection. May the power that raised up Jesus from the dead raise you up today. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen and amen and amen. God bless you.